Hello, my name is Silent Gimmon, and I am the owner of the trustisyou.com. The reason I am doing this is because so many investors do not realize that capital gains is 23.8% on all your um, profits. I don't care if you're a real estate investor, crypto uh, investor, mining, stock market, stock market, forex, or for futures. Because right now, capital gains are going to be quite high come April April 15th, 2023. Now, with the Spendthrift Trust, you can defer capital gains into the future. I have done a few stories about some very high network people saving money. I'm going to do with one of my properties that was rather smaller. Um, I have been a real estate investor since uh, February of 2019. Um, got really into uh, doing bank rate, no uh, bank owned properties and notes. Uh, when uh, COVID started to happen, uh, actually this was before COVID. One of the notes that we bought that we knew we called the Christmas note because they for four years they didn't pay uh, a Jan a December and January. They got over over budget for uh, for Christmas. So we got the note at a massive da discount. Unfortunately, we bought we I got the note in April of 2019 and uh, they made one payment on time. Woohoo! I got one payment on time. Uh, then they sent a check for two payments that bounced, which meant I had to cover that check, which really pissed me off. So I shouldn't have said that word. I'm sorry. Really annoyed me. And then it was one country uh, song after another country song. This was in Memphis, Tennessee. Um, I bought the note for, let me, I'm checking my notes real quick, $15,400. Um, we did ca a cash for keys. We uh, told them they had to get out. We were 17 hours away from getting uh, in uh, Tennessee, so it's a forfeiture. 17 hours away from going to a forfeiture and ki kicking them out when they got shut down because of COVID. Those lucky people got to live there all during COVID rent-free. I wish I could live rent-free, but it wasn't happening. Um, uh, COVID got lifted on uh, in August, August 3rd. We uh, had an attorney in, in uh, Memphis. We, they, we were able to send a letter saying, this is how much you owe us. You have 30 days to pay for this. All of a sudden, the brother got involved. The brother's just like, they can't afford this. And I'm like, well, they've been living rent-free. What are they going to do? Uh, again, the courts got shut down for a second time in Tennessee. So things got put on hold. It is a note. The note means that I am the mortgage on the house. I don't own the house. I own the paper on the house. So uh, what we came up with, the brother found somebody who would invest, who would, uh, take over the house, put them into a smaller house. Um, I'm not trying to make fun of these people, but they were on Social Security. They were getting $1,200 a month, every single month from Social Security, and that what they owed us for the mortgage in the house was $453. Not a huge amount of money. I mean, they, they decided not to pay their mortgage. I, I'm not trying to be an org or anything else. Um, my mother, who lost her house when she was six years old, um, my grandfather died in December of 1939. His two sisters kicked my grandmother and my mom out of the house. She made me promise I would never foreclose on anybody. She was okay with me foreclosing on these people. So we were able to get uh, the people in this house in Memphis to sign over what's called a land deal to change the note into an actual piece of property. I was able to sell it to the investor for uh, for $31,000. I bought it for $15,400. I'm selling it for $31,000. Yes, I made a profit. It did take me uh, quite some time to get from 2019 to 2021, uh, two years to get the profit. But just to give you an idea, with capital gains on that little uh, bit of profit, it was going to be $3,712. Thank God it was in the trust because that's that's some money. I mean, I was, I'm not making fantastic money on this note uh, that turned into a land deal. But, you know, this every single time they had to buy a new car. I don't know why they had to buy a new car. They never told us that part. Um, he got injured and couldn't go back to work. Uh, this happened, that happened, this happened, that happened. A water pipe burst and I, and I should pay for it. I'm like, no, 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 no. I'm the mortgage. You're the homeowner. I'm the mortgage. So... Is, that was the last note I've had. Um, quite frankly, I've not gotten into more notes. Um, I just got, kind of burned on them. But I was able to save $3,712 in capital gains on my 2021 uh, uh, federal taxes. That helped a lot. Again, the spendthrift trust I talk about has five words to it. It is uh, irrevocable, complex, 
discretionary, non-grantor, spendthrift trust. It is very specialized, it is patent. Uh, so uh, there's a patent with it. it, it um, it's written under uh, IRS code 6, 643B as in Bravo. And it is to help investors. Again, if you're a real estate investor, crypto investor, crypto miner, stock market investor, options investor, uh, day trader, Forex, anything, any investor, or you have royalties. I will tell you about uh, two of my songwriters that I, I have it for who have the trust too. Thank you so much for listening to this. This is Sally Gimmon. I am the owner of the trustisyou.com. Also another website for y'all to check out if you can't afford the trust um, that I just started. 80% of Americans have more than $90,000 in debt and are not saving 10% uh, for retirement. I have started uh, at Learning with Sally Marie. I have my uh, circle of wealth and five simple steps, all for just starting with $10. You can start paying down your debt, uh, getting into the gift giving tree, getting into starting a business, um, doing other things to start saving as much money as possible. Thank you for listening to me today. I hope y'all have a beautiful uh, week then. Take care.